Stormworms tag China her and it's official. T-Mobile officially acquires Met Mobile, so I'm on friendlyrunner.com here. And so it says that T-Mobile announces deal to acquire Met Mobile, Ultra Mobile, and Plum to expand its prepaid services. So, th so this is really cool. So as you guys know, Met Mobile uses T-Mobile's uh, towers for service. So now T-Mobile finally owns uh, Met Mobile, so that's pretty cool. So let's go check this out here. So you did that to see right there. Pretty cool there. It says today, today is March 15th when I, when I am recording this video here. It says today T-Mobile has officially announced that via blog post that it has entered an agreement to acquire. I can't even say that K word. The parent company and Met Mobile, Ultra Mobile and Plum. The acquisition is uh, the acquisition is to take a place later in the year and will allow Mint to retain its current marketing strategy as well as its most popular $15 USD plan. So, the, uh, so don't look like that's what I'm trying. Uh, the announcement was also highlighted in the form in the form of a YouTube video starring T-Mobile CEO Mike Siever with Mint Mobile's part owner and full time business mogul and part time actor Ryan Reynolds, of course, keeping with what he's become Mint Mobile's marketing strategy. The video covers the most important points regarding the acquisition while also keeping it light and humorous. So, y'all got some check out the video right there, and I will have a link down below as well. So pretty cool there. Uh, the details of the agreement states that the companies in question will continue to have access to T-Mobile's network including 5G. As the NVNO has been doing so for years now. However, by acquiring their sales, marketing, marketing digital and support operations, T-Mobile hopes to leverage its supplier connections and deliver scale to keep to help the companies expand their products to more price conscious customers in the United States. Because uh, y'all guys know that Mint Mobile is very affordable. They have very affordable plans and stuff like that. So, yeah. Uh, as part of its wider portfolio, T Mobile will also be able to use Mint's top digital direct to customer marketing skills to expand into new customer segments and Geographics. These marketing strategies have proven to be quite effective so far while handled by Maximum Effort, a marketing firm owned by Ryan Reynolds himself and responsible for the campaigns behind the Deadpool movie franchise. Aviation, GenMets.com, and others. Mike Seaver, CEO of T-Mobile, stated, and, and, and here is what he said, quote, Mint has built an incredibly successful digital direct-to-customer business that continues to deliver for customers on the uncarrier leading 5G network, and now we are excited to use our scale and earnings economics to help supercharge it and ultra mobile into the future. Over the long term, we will also benefit from applying the marketing, by applying the marketing formula Mint has become famous for across parts, across more parts of T-Mobile. We think customers are really going to win with a more competitive and expensive Mint and Ultra, end quote. T existing what the hell? T existing mobile prepaid offerings matched by T Mobile. T Mobile branded prepaid and connect by T Mobile are complemented by the Mint and Ultra names. Additionally one the trend it says additionally once the transaction is finalized, Mint co founders 
David Gluckman and Rizwan Chasm will stay on at T-Mobile to continue leading the businesses. Men's co-owner Ryan Reynolds will keep up with will keep up his position as the company's chief creative officer. So that is pretty cool. Says to purchase. K K E N. I'm guessing that's how you say that. I'm not. I'm not sure how you say that. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. Says T-Mobile will pay up to one hundred to one point thirty-five billion dollars split between cash payments, thirty-nine percent, interest, sixty-one percent, and contingent upon the company's financial results. The deal is anticipated to complete later this year, pending. The fulfillment of c- c- customary closing conditions. As far as what changes meant mobile subscribers can expect, we don't know how. We don't know how. We don't know much at this point, other than promise to keep the current fifteen dollars per month pricing, which includes limitless calls and texts, as well as up to four gigabytes of data per month. So, so uh, yeah, T-Mobile has officially announced the acquisition of Mint Mobile, Ultra Mobile, and Plum to expand its prepaid services. So, the acquisition is supposed to close later this year. So, on um, that is really cool. So, all we know about the uh, acquisition so far is that T-Mobile is, T-Mobile is going to keep Mint's fifteen dollar plan for now. They are going to keep that for right now. That's all we know. About the um, about the acquisition for now, I'm sure that we'll learn more stuff about what's coming as time goes on. So stay t- so stay tuned for that. So uh yeah, this is really cool, and I think that um, you know, it could expand Mint Mobile's uh footprint a little bit, and they could help Mint Mobile uh, succeed even more, because Mint Mobile is popular because they have uh, affordable plans with uh with great data options. And Mint Mobile already uses T-Mobile's network anyway, so, you know, why not? So, yeah, I see this as a positive for the prepaid space, you know, so, yeah, you got a lot of prepaid carriers out there, and, um, and Mint Mobile is very competitive, and, like I said, they have very affordable plans with great data options for each plan, so, um, yeah, so this is the beginning of what's to come with the new acquisition. So stay tuned for that. So, um, yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. If you like my a lot, please rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.